Greetings, Souls Wind here, and welcome to Let's Play Cooking Simulator. The developers sure haven't been resting, and so shall I not rest as well. There's another update on the 10th of June. It's about the pizza DLC. And I saw what's been updated, I was really, really, really excited about it. If you refer to the game's Steam Store page and the updates, you would have known what are the updates. But for those who don't know, maybe I shall introduce them by starting a new game. You see that there's a new game here on the quick save, that's because... Yeah, that was a problem. Even the menu music wasn't there, and I had to launch a game to find out what's wrong with the music. Indeed, there's just no sound at all, even in the new game, so I had to do a Steam Verify and uh, reacquire some of the files, and then it worked. Now there's sound, and we can finally find out what's with the updates. Now, shall we start a new game? I'm gonna be really curious about something, though. Tutorial, however... You know what, let's uh, go with the tutorial. It's been a while since I played the game, I think tutorial just might be better. And we can focus more on the new features than to try and recall everything. It's version 5.2. Okay, pause first. Now, let me talk about this ad hoc series. It's gonna be for the update, and what's the update? It's the custom menu for the pizza DLC. Pretty much like the base game, without the custom menu, we're gonna be overwhelmed with all sorts of recipes, everything, and then we gotta prepare so many ingredients and have them all over the floor. So, with the custom recipe, we can limit what's being ordered for a particular day. And I feel that's really, really important. Not only that, but in a pizzeria, you don't really get to choose whatever you want. You have a recipe, you can tweak the recipe, like have more of an ingredient, less of another ingredient, for example, but generally follow the menu, whichever is on the menu for that day. You have to follow that menu. And that's what we're gonna do. We now have custom menu, but my guess is that it's not available on the first day because we don't have many recipes to offer. There's one more update that I'm very, very excited about. Remember I just said that we're gonna have ingredients on the floor because, you know, there's so many recipes and whatnot, and the custom menu sort of relieved this problem. But I lamented about this many, many times. That is, the GN containers are scattered all over the floor as you've seen in my Let's Play. There has been an update for the GN container drawer, and yeah, that was a lag, that's why I didn't want to move. This one... <laughs> Yeah, you see this? We can press the Z key and the Z key. Oh, wow. We can cycle through everything. So we can choose how we want to arrange everything and have nothing on the floor. That's going to be really lovely. So, <laughs> yeah, that's something really nice. And also the Pizza Pro app with the new pizza recipes tab. We can choose which pizzas a certain ingredient is used in. And then also the basket model got changed. There were some bug fixes and blocking of uh, completion for some quests and achievements. Those have been fixed. Right, we have a margarita over here that we need to prepare. So there is that. And then uh, these are the GN containers. Uh, these are some of the examples here. We can cycle through these things. I pressed the T key already. Alright, uh, let's go through this. I think we're gonna go through an entire career mode again. Anyway, bring this up, put this on here. I hope that the food don't fall through the floor again, okay? Just put it here and then roll out the pizza. Okay, good. Next, we wanna switch to the GN container. Press the W key, very intuitive. This is here, and then click to pour, and then just spread the sauce. And then press the W key and W key again, use it on the highlighted one, which is probably this one. Is that it? No, it's a cheese one. Okay, I went too far ahead. It's this one. Alright, we can rotate it. Q and E to rotate. Alright, sure, no problem. Rotate this and rotate this. Oh, come on. I clicked already. It didn't work. Right, press the W key or the S key. Wait, hang on. The S key to the herb selection all the way, and then click on this one. 
and then down and back to here and then we can place it like that yeah now what now we can pick up the pizza but before that we need this one first put it into here What if we leave it on the floor? Will it still be, um, can we toss it away? No, we cannot. Can we put it inside? Yeah, we can. Pizza peel. Okay, the temperature seems okay. Oh, aha, there's a problem there. <laughs> Not been fixed yet. Take this one and then click to put it inside the oven. Uh, A and D. All right, and then click. Wait for the pizza to finish baking. So we're gonna just wait a little bit. Leave this here, or just throw it on the floor, doesn't matter. All right, we gotta make sure that the temperature stays up. Oh no, one more, it might be too much. Leave it back. Wait for the pizza to finish. Nope, not yet. Leave it there, prepare a plate. A small plate will do. Okay, it's almost done. Click and take it out. All right, look at that. Bring it over to the plate. All right, toss it on the floor. Click on it and then serve. There we go. Yeah, we got the five stars. Ingredients all good. That's it. So press T to continue and that's all. Now we need to prepare dough saws and other ingredients. So put this away somewhere safe and neat. Press T. Uh, the preparation phase has no time limit. You can decide when to start the day. So let's prepare some Nepalitan style dough. Launch the app here. Click on this dough and then pin. And then press the button. Oh wait, no, 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 no. The Q key, this one. Quests. So we need to prepare 3000 of Nepalitan pizza. All right, quest for fame and whatnot. Guide us through, Novus. Okay, guide us through. Come on, guide us, please. Yeah, 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 yeah. Follow the green line to... What? Here? Okay. According to the recipe, so buy a bag of flour. Put it on the dough thingy. Add 3.5. And then salt, water, and yeast. Can we put them here? We can't. Okay, same thing. Put them on the floor. Salt, water, and yeast. Yeast. We'll just buy a few. Salt. And uh, liquids will be water. It's easier to take from here, I think. Than to use the jug or something. Yeah, just uh, take it from here. Water, there we go. This will be one liter. Toss that away. Which is 400 ml. Uh oh, there's a little bit too much, but I think we're fine. Yeast. 10 grams and salt 125. We have a basket over there, but we're not using it. There we go. We can change the amount and that's very important. Pour 10. And then pour 5. There we go, exit and it saves. Now we need to close the lever and begin work. So, you know what? We can actually go over here. 
Uh, I think it was referring to this basket, right? All right, let's bring this basket up. Hey, there's one more over here. <laughs> but it's fine. We're just gonna like have a container. Oh, 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 whoa, whoa, whoa. Water, yeast, and salt. And this will be the, I don't know, whatever. Leave it here. Right, let's go to the lever. And then we can start uh, this one. Press T to continue. Okay, there we go. And we have got the quest completed, haven't we? Yeah, okay, marinara sauce. So we gotta pin the marinara sauce. Pin it. Alright, now open. Do we have like a container? Yeah, we have, over here. Isn't that awesome? Good. Now follow the green line to the pantry. Oh, we need this one, of course. Uh, the There's a bit of motion sickness from all the movement, even though I changed the mouse sensitivity. Okay, there we go. Then this is 1.6. Oh, we still cannot hold to buy more quickly, huh? Follow the green line. Marinara sauce. Empty it into here, the food processor thingy. You'll not be able to remove anything from it, so we gotta put in the right amount. Press T to continue. Put down the basket, take a look at it. If there's something wrong, you should take it out. Press T, okay, put everything in that's there already. Oh, we can't put it there anymore, so, uh, throw it there. Oh, did I just... Ha 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 A basket would break the glass. How interesting, isn't it? How very interesting. A barium to pick up this one and then put it in here. We need basil. That's 30 grams. And then we need olive oil, which we'll have to buy. And pour 200 ml in here. Uh oh. Wait, what was that thing? Come on, what's that thing? Oh, it's just a box to buy things. Leave this here. No, I think I'm gonna leave this here. On here. Can I can I move it here and then leave it on here? I think it's better this way. Okay, salt. Salt is over here. Salt is 35. We have got 5 and then we got 10. Oregano 25. Oregano. Wait. Here. This one, five twenty-five. Okay, there it is, and all of these will go in here. Now, with that all done, we're gonna press. No, <laughs> we're gonna put the G in container. Okay, press T, and then press this button. Yeah, we got the other quest now. Let's check out the quest, and we want to complete as many as possible. Cutting machine, 300 grams of any ingredients. Okay. So we won't be needing this anymore. Can we unpin? Oh, okay. We can unpin them. Okay, cool. Yeah, now what? Pick up the basket, go back to the pantry. Okay, gather ingredients for tomorrow. Mozzarella. White onion. Salami. And sweet corn. Black olive. 
I wouldn't think Salami 300 is okay. I would think because like a GN container is like, I don't know, one or two kilos. So I would think get three at least and we'll see how it fills up. Similarly for this and this, it's 500 grams. So we're going to get more. And uh, this one too. Because like it's only 100 grams. We got like, I don't know, three. Is that it? We got three. That's 10. Mozzarella? Oh, come on. Yeah, it's so difficult to... Look. Oh my goodness. You got one, right? Yeah, we're getting five. And we should close this. Nah, doesn't matter. Let's go back. Put the basket down here. Oh no. Take the GN container. Out of the food processing. <laughs> and then follow the green line to here. Bring this over. The sauce would be... I don't know. Marinara sauce. Another marinara sauce. Yeah, sure. Why not? Can we take it out? Come on, pick up, right? Where's the pick up? Oh my goodness. Uh, oh my goodness, I can't even see the pick up button. If I were to go over here, will I be able to see the pick up button? No, what is the pick up button? It's being covered. E. E. E is the pick up button. Put it there. Yeah. So we finish this, then use that one. Pick up the salami. And then put it into the cutter. Insert a uh, container. And then turn on the green button. So I'm just gonna put in more salami. Okay, we'll... No, no, no. I don't want to risk it. No. Okay, just put this in here. Okay, 900 grams. Pick up the mozzarella, and then put it into here, and then put this one into here, and then put some more of the mozzarella. You know what? I'm going to try this. Okay, I'm just going to pick up everything because I forgot. Alright, just pick up everything. And then one onion, and then put it in here. Only mozzarella goes in. Awesome. Good enough for me. Okay, put this back in here. This one goes back to here. Electric grater. Here. This one we take out. Oh, it's full. So one kilo is the right one. Yeah, just like that one. One kilo is the right one. So salami will not be here because salami is meat. And therefore, we're already going to sort this. Okay. So we start with the cheese first, and then we'll go with the meat, and then finally fruits and vegetables. So meat goes there. Okay. The second one will be cheese. Okay. And the first one is the sauce. This is the cheese. It doesn't look good. It triggers uh, something called trypophobia, in a way, but whatever. Cut and grated mozzarella. Yeah, like that. Cut and grated, cut and grated. One white onion. <laughs> we have got more. Put that in there. Pick up the basket of ingredients and click it here. Oh, I didn't need to try that. Just put it in here. Lovely. Awesome. There we go. Put that there and then just click. 1.2? Wait. Uh, that's a lot. That's way too much. So we have a uh, 200. We're gonna discard that. This is uh, onion, so that's gonna be the last one. Right here. Next would be MTGN container in the highlighted spot. So we need to buy a GN container. Okay, and then pour these in here. Yeah, awesome.
just pour everything. It takes a kilo. Of course you would knock that down. Why wouldn't you? And why wouldn't you just like fly up like that? Of course you would. Porn. Oh, it saves. And then black olives too. We're gonna... Oh, these are four sources. So let's get another GN container. And put this in here. It looks really cool though, like that. But it takes a long time. Just take a look at this animation go. Nope. Put that in here, please. Thank you. Less than one gram of corn in there, huh? Awesome. Okay, can we toss these away? Without the basket being tossed away. Press T. Black olives. Go here. Last icon means that it can store directly into a container. Okay, that we know. Put a container with 500 grams of black olives for cutting. Oh, I need some more. Okay. Okay, can I buy from here, please? I think we should be able to buy from here. No, we should not. <laughs> nope. This one, thank you. If only I can zoom out a little bit. It feels like it's way too zoomed in. Like, very cluttered screen, you know? Feels really zoomed in. Whenever I'm holding a basket. Okay, pour this in here. Yeah, just toss that away. We have plenty of time. We can prepare however much we want. Then pour this away. Throw this away. Now we can start this. 500 grams? Nope. We have a kilo. This is a cut one and this is the other one. The normal one. Pick up the dough tray. Follow the green line. Over to here. Go to the marked area. Finish the preparation phase. Oh, no, we are not. No, we're not. We're gonna keep the dough in here. Can we close it? We can't because it is blocked. No, because it's still blocked. So split it into portions and throw that in there. Put that in here. How about this? Nope. Nope. <laughs> nope. It's stuck open. Yeah, awesome. Lovely. Wonderful. Ha 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 ha. Oh my goodness. Well, we gotta get a few more GN containers before we go off. So let's just get the GN container. Because we have to prepare anyways, right? And do we have other sources we want to prepare? Or can we fulfill more quests? Complete an order, that's a quest. <laughs> we want to finish these as fast as possible. Are you serious? Are you really serious about this? You know what? I'm gonna try something, okay? We're gonna get another tray. Just buy one more tray. Oh my goodness, okay. We're gonna get everything. Can we get everything? Nope, we can't scroll and get everything. How nice. 
How nice. We can't even scroll to get everything. Nope. If it even says why, that would be nice, but it doesn't say why. All right, it's fine. Throw this here. And we'll leave that open. Maybe it's glitched. A medium plate. And I think that's fine. Okay, now we're going to end the day and end the episode. So we got one. <laughs> Five stars, and that's it. So we're gonna end the episode here. We saw how the GN container drawer was really way improved now. And we know for sure we are not gonna have the trays all over the floor. I'm very excited about this feature. And also the custom menu for whenever it comes out, because it's still not available yet. We only have one menu. Thank you so much for watching. That's all I have for now. Have a nice day. And I have a motion sickness. I don't know why. Point of view? Maybe. Don't know.